a recall issued a decade ago. Carfax says more than 6.4 million vehicles in America still have recall Takata airbags in them. Those airbags pose a risk for injury, even death. Our Nidia Han has been on top of this story from the very beginning all those years ago. She joins us now live in studio with the latest today. Nidia. Brian, there is a new urgent warning from federal safety officials. The National Highway Traffic Safety Administration has issued a do not drive warning for more vehicles that still have these recall Takata airbags. They added the 2002 to 2006 Nissan Sentra, the 2002 to 2006 and four Nissan Pathfinder and some Infiniti QX4s. What the automaker is saying is park the car. We'll send a tow truck, take it to the dealership, fix it for free and bring it back to you. Carfax just released a report that says despite being recalled 10 years ago, more than 6 million vehicles in the U.S. are still equipped with Takata airbags. The airbags, which can potentially send flying shrapnel when deployed in a crash, have been blamed for at least 27 deaths in the U.S. and at least 400 injuries. Do you know how many vehicles in Pennsylvania and in Philadelphia still have these Takata airbags inside? More than 204,000 vehicles in Pennsylvania, more than 120,000 in the Philadelphia region need to get these airbags replaced. Now, vehicles manufactured by 19 automakers have been recalled. The airbags were installed between the model years 2001 and 2015. Again, if your vehicle is on the do not drive list, that means the airbags must be replaced before you can safely operate your vehicles again. And it's more likely that these airbags will suddenly deploy when they've been in heat, correct? Heat and humidity um, are some of the determining factors that make this airbag much more potent than it's supposed to be. So especially before these summer months, people need to get these out of their cars. For a lot of owners, these airbags have been in their car for uh, a decade or more. And so, you know, every summer is adding more and more risk. Yeah, so one of the issues is that some of these vehicles are not being driven by their original owner since they're old. So any current owner needs to check to see if the airbag still needs to be replaced. We've put the entire list of affected cars and information on how to check the airbag status for your specific vehicle on 6abc.com.